what's going on uh, today we are going to solve problem number 670 which is maximum swap so the problem is given a non-negative integer you could swap only two digit at most once to get the maximum valued number so your job is to swap only two numbers and get the maximum number so for instance if i look here here i can only swap two numbers so in this case it is 2736 so i can only swap 7 and 2 to get the largest number right i cannot swap any other number so my goal is to i'll scan to write and find out which is the largest number and then take that largest number and swap it now take this example in this case we cannot perform any swap because all the numbers are in decreasing order so 9973 there is nothing in increasing order now and similarly if you look at this problem there is a 9978 so we come here we look for the uh, smallest largest number there is nothing larger than 9 right so we'll skip it 9 is larger we'll skip it now 7 is there anything larger than 9 7 yes 9 is there is 9 is there after 7 nope is then we'll look for 8 is 8 there after 7 yep it's there so we found the 8 index and then swap it and then we get the largest number so there are um, there are multiple ways to solve this. One of the ways, uh, what you can do is you fix your index, and then after that index, you start searching at the right, find the largest number, and then scan it. Then you go to the if you don't find anything, then you go to the second index, then you start doing it. So in that case, uh, the best case complexity will be o to the power n because in that case you will get the number with the first scan itself, but the worst case will be n square because every time you go here and then you will st start scanning then you come here then you start scanning right now can we solve this problem in better way yes we can do it so what we have to do is we have to create a hash map like this so look at this thing so i have created a hash map which is 2 is at index 0 7 is at index 1 3 is index so value is there and then the index is there now when i'm looking at this 2 I'll start looking from 9 is 9 is there nope is 8 is there nope is 7 is there yes I found 7 here so in that case I'm not scanning I'm just searching in this hash map right so yes 7 is there what is the index of 7 1 then swipe 2 and 7 and get the largest number that's it so let's start coding so the first step is this is a number so what we have to do is we have to convert each digit of the number into a list so the best way to do that is what we will do is we will use um, map I mean I can do it using list comprehension but this is much easier so um, uh, this is int and then I'll say str now so basically this will convert it to a string and then map will start try to convert everything into a integer and then I'll convert this into list and now now what is the next step so the next step is we will create a hash map so our hash map will be we'll say value should be first val should be first then index right and then we'll say for for index comma val in enumerate uh, now now this will give us index and value and then we will store value and index but remember one thing since we are forming a dictionary so in this scenario right when it creates it there are two nines so it will store index of nine which comes after it so which is good for us right because if there are two eight eight and then we want to swipe the last eight not the first eight so in that case it will take care of it now what is the next step what is the next thing that we should do now the next thing is we will start looking uh, each of the numbers so we'll say n in uh, we will again say index comma value in enumerate and now right now after this we will have another loop what that loop will does is say that will be a search value in range and then you will say 9 and we will start looking from 9 to where 9 to till value because if for example if you are searching here we can only go till uh, 3 we don't have to search for 2 because 2 is already there right we have to find the largest number so we will go from 9 to value and then minus 1 since we are going in reverse direction 
and now I will I look for this search value search val in hash map if this value is found in hash map and there is one more thing which we have to check uh, that is and hash map search well is should be greater than index so it should be greater than the index of the number so for example if i'm looking here 9 and i i'm trying to find the if if suppose that i'm looking for 7 right i'm i'm here 7 i'm looking for 8 so 8 index should be greater than that if there is 8 something here like for instance here then it doesn't make any sense because I have to look for 8 which is which comes after 7 so that's the reason this condition is here now if I found this thing what I will do is I'll perform a swap so my swap will be uh, num index is equal to uh, that will be num and then hash map search value right and then similarly i'll copy this comma comma num index that's it and then we will return num here but remember this num we have converted into a list so we have to convert it back into a number right so how we are going to do it I can I can again use a map here and then what I will do is map and then I'll convert each of the number into a string right and then I will use dot join make it as a string and then convert back into a number and then is it then no there is one more thing that we have to take care of it. What is that thing? So just for example, if everything is 9973, then you will never come here, right? So in that case, what you will do is, you will just take this line and return it. I think I have to give one more space and that's it, done. So, Let's try to run this. Yep, see accepted, I'll submit it and success. That's it, thank you guys for watching it. If you like my channel, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much.